719 cases of Dos Equis beer, one big pot plant, and a pile of illegal weapons. That's what a joint operation between Austin police and three other agencies just seized. KXAN's Kevin Schwaller got the briefing from investigators and shows us the surprises that were waiting for them. To give you an idea of how much beer police found, it filled this entire trailer more than 700 cases. This is no beer truck. This booze is now evident. Police took it as part of a bust in Bastrop County. APD started investigating $90,000 worth of alcohol reported stolen from an Austin distributor last month. Wednesday, APD, the Texas Alcoholic Beverage Commission, and the USATF seized this beer, more than $100,000 and 20 guns. Police say one of the guns is a prohibited short barrel rifle obtained illegally and two of the guns were stolen. Right now, two men face charges. Police arrested Byron Arana and Wilmar Arana for misdemeanor distributing alcohol without a license. Police believe the people who stole the beer were reselling it and they are still investigating a larger ring. Theft is pretty common, but it's unusual for this much alcohol. In 20 years of law enforcement, I've never heard of over $90,000 worth of beer being stolen. Again, police arrested two people on those misdemeanor charges. With all this, though, they say it's possible those get upgraded and also that more people face charges in the future. Reporting in Austin, Kevin Schwaller, KXAN investigates. And we want you to see a closer look at where this operation all unfolded. It's a rural area on Old San Antonio Road in Dale, Texas. That's southeast of Austin's airport. In addition to the police and TABC cases, the Bastrop County Animal Cruelty Unit is also investigating something found at this scene. We're still working to learn the details about that.